striking. I can use that shuffle step to strike to the body. I can use that shuffle step to get inside and get to the jaw. Most of your knockouts are going to happen because you get hit right on the button. We'll cover that in a separate video though on areas to strike, the vulnerable parts of the body. So I can shuffle step, strike to the body, shuffle step, and strike to the jaw. I can also use that same shuffle step to set up and get in here for a single to get past a jab. I can get in here and get a double or transition to the back. So the shuffling, the types of footwork that you use are not just used for striking. They can be used to set up takedowns. So if the stances don't match up here, I would have to C-step to get into the legs and transition to my takedowns. That same footwork that you're using to avoid strikes and to counter strike can also be used to set up your takedowns and to clinch. So if you're not winning this exchange, right, and you're taking strikes, you're gonna take them anyway, right? If that person is better at striking, go ahead and try to use those counters to get past and to clinch and use that footwork so that you always have an open area to move. Ideally, we're moving at a 45 degree angle. So if this makes a hard right angle here, I wanna move off to a 45 when I circle around somebody.